guys thanks for joining us again today we are on our way into the Pernalulu National Park so keen and it's been like top of our bucket list for so long so we're really oh. really keen it's a uh, 53 kilometer corrugated road in there's a few creek crossings we just let the tires down to 30 it's been fine now a few people on wiki camp said it takes two and a half hours Google Maps but, said an hour and 45 yeah. but it's so funny though because we just spent the night at a roadside rest stop and it literally looks like it's just there where we're heading but yeah it's not it's far away it's really far <laughs> it's very it's like lots of windy roads but so far we're halfway there it's looking good mm -hmm. um, we do not know what we're in for uh, so we're gonna bring you along and let's find out made it to our first walk of the day which was like number one on my list and I didn't think we'd be doing it until tomorrow but the lady at the information desk suggested that we come and do it now because apparently it's the best time of day for it between 11 and 12 so what happens is the sunlight hits the gorge perfectly and we should see a really cool like glow yeah at the end of the chasm so the lady made it sound awesome so Can you say where we were yeah, we're at Echidna, sorry. We're at a Echidna Chasm. Echidna Chasm, is that how you say it? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, mate. Look at this. Look how big they are. There's Pretty only, cool. Only one kilometre there and one okay. kilometre back. One kilometre there, one kilometre back, yeah. Hey, some palm trees, mate. Anyway, we'll see you when we get there. What do you think? This is definitely not an instant burst reality. I'm this is speechless. the most beautiful thing we have ever seen in our lives. I can't believe it. It is incredible. Maybe this, we shouldn't have come here first because how are we going to top this This now? beats Fraser Island. <laughs> Fraser Island is now second on the list. This is number one, eight. This is just incredible. Look at it. So there's still half an hour till the sun actually comes over the top and really bright, um, makes it shine in there. So we're gonna wait half an hour and see how we go. series just there and it's got a wicked V8 noise going on. <laughs> um, here you go, what do you want? Um, just an apple please. Coming right up. Thank you. Um, man, this place is next level. It's so cool. It, it's like, I was coming in and I was like, oh, I wonder if it's like what it looks like on the photos and it is more than that. It's incredible. But uh, where are we going now? Uh, I forgot the name of it. Um, How's the endorphins going? <laughs> it's like I've had five coffees. 
I think it's called the mini palms. Mini palms. Oh, heaps Walk of palm trees. Board. Yeah, I think right. so. Well, there were quite a few palm trees in that one, so I'm excited to see what yeah. is going on with this one. Anyway, we'll see you there. Alrighty guys, we made it to our camp spot and it is magnificent. Always good when there's shade at your camp spot. And it is lunch time. We didn't end up going for that walk. Explain why please, Megan. Well, <laughs> I kind of read the map wrong. I, I thought see. that what I thought was a road was actually the walking track. So they all started at that echidna chasm. Yeah, we got and it completely wrong. had to walk from there, but I thought you had to drive from there. And yeah, we realized when we we're like, what? 15 k's down Way the road. too far. And usually we would turn around and go back, but we're really low on fuel I stuffed, as well, up, I so. stuffed up with fuel. I didn't realize that you had to do all this driving. Like it's, it's quite a bit of driving in the park, eh? Yeah. Didn't realize, so I'm being safe, not sorry. <laughs> <laughs> but um, lunchtime, I'm starving. What all are you that, gonna have? I don't know. <laughs> I think you're gonna have to have wheat picks or something. I, ate, I We get um, mixed meat sandwiches and I ate all of mine yesterday, so. <laughs> I don't so get I one today. I still have a delicious roll for lunch today, but Jack I don't ate know. both his yesterday. I'll work out what I'm going to have. <laughs> anyway, we uh, decided to not fully set up here today, and we're going to pack up again, and we're going to go look at a sun Well, it's just a, a, a lookout nearby, yeah. but it's a full moon tonight, yeah. and obviously all of the sunsets up here are amazing. So Yeah, we're going to go to that so hopefully no sunset. One pinches, maybe we should leave some camp chairs here so no one pinches our good camp spot while yeah, we're out. Again. Doesn't matter. That's all right. It'll be dark anyway. The sun will be gone. True, but it's nice. Anyway, we're going to we'll see at the we'll see at the sunset. Alrighty guys, it is almost that time of the day. The best time of the day. Look at the rock formations over there. Yeah, they're just stunning. But first, we're just prepping up some dinner. So we got that prawn dish excited. again. Eh? This is like my new favourite dinner. So yeah. I tried to explain it last time, but we we're still waiting for everything to cool down. Yeah. Um, so we've got chilli prawns, sushi, sticky sushi rice, coleslaw, avocado and cucumber. cucumber. And oh my God, it's so good. And if you have like the Japanese mayo, it would be so good. But we've got it is, uh, yeah. it's pretty good. Um, but I reckon the sunset's gonna be awesome. Mm -hmm. So uh, we're gonna enjoy the sunset, guys, and we'll see you in the morning for a little sunrise mission. I can't wait, eh? Yeah. <laughs> see you then. I wanted to escape for a while. I called a couple of friends and we went out. But I never thought I'd see your face. I really wanted to escape, but it was just too late. Someone said you knew how to turn around. Suddenly you're there sitting in the crowd Everything comes back in the blink of an eye It's like you're mine, you're still mine We skip the small talk Cause you know me better than I Know myself on my speed a while now Since I saw you But it feels like yesterday somehow Morning guys, we've made it for our little sunrise mission this morning and I don't know if you can see that in the background but it is incredible. It is next level. We have never seen anything like this. Megan's just over there taking a photo. It is just, can't even explain it. It's incredible. I don't even, <laughs> I don't even know what to say. But anyway, 
we're going to make some breakfast and we're going to get off on our uh, hikes this morning there's a few around here um, we're just going to go check as many as we can out so we'll bring you along Look at that. All the hikes seem to be pretty easy, so. Yeah. This is wicked. Wow. Holy moly. It's like looking over the Pride Lands. <laughs> Look at that one in the middle. Spectacular. So cool. All right, so what's this place called? Pick a, pick Pick a Ninny. Ninny. Look out. Look out. Did you say Piccadilly? Piccadilly. We've been playing too much Monopoly. <laughs> We've been playing heaps of Monopoly. <laughs> um, yeah, so definitely come here. I reckon we just chill here for like 10 minutes just yeah. enjoying it. All of the walks just stem off each other from the car park. Yeah. And I was getting worried. I was thinking, where's this lookout? Have we passed already? Because we just passed so many spectacular viewpoints. But I think it's pretty obvious that this is the one that we were. They just keep towards. going as long as your eye can see. Yeah, it's crazy. But they're everywhere. This is wicked. we come to we've come to the elephant rock apparently this rock formation looks like an elephant can you see it Megan yeah can you see it yeah yeah I see it pretty cool That's funny. <laughs> we did all our walks yeah so we're on our way out now we just did three in that I think it's the Whoop. southern area of the park yeah so. yeah I think we're getting a lot better. When we first left on our trip, we had a lot of FOMO, and whenever we come to places like this, we felt like we had to do every single walk yeah. and see everything that there is to see, but pretty content with what we've seen today. It's you don't need been, to see everything. No, nah, I mean, it's just been awesome what we have seen, so. Yeah, we're yeah. pretty happy. We like There's so much to see, but if you try and do everything, you get pretty stressed out and tired. Not stressed, but you get, t you get tired, and yeah. then you're not enjoying it. So we've basically picked three or four three or four things and yeah. and we've absolutely loved it it would have been good to do that other one yesterday if we hadn't stuffed up with our fuel yeah. and stuff but <laughs> but yeah. still it's been absolutely amazing and i think um the way that we've done our camp was really good as well yeah it, like it was um unintentional but because we stayed at the one closer to these southern walks it was easier for us to go do them in the morning, in the morning and yeah. everything was really shaded and it's not too hot yeah. so so there's two campsite sites at this place. Yeah, so two of the can, national park ones. So. You're going to stay two nights, stay at that one mm -hmm. for the um, sun coming over the yeah, mountain the thing. <laughs> and then go to the other one for the uh, morning walks. Yeah. yeah. Um, anyway, that is all our walks done. And now we just got corrugations to tackle and a few water, water crossings. crossings. <laughs> and then lunch. And then it's lunch time. <laughs> all right, we'll stop rambling. See you soon.
Alrighty guys, we made it safely off the track. It is a rough track. Yeah, yeah. You, you need to let your tyres down 100%. <laughs> there was a bloke broken down in a 79 series uh, four-door ute. His diesel fuel line came undone from basically, I think it's from going up and down, up and down, like that. So uh, we figured that out. And I'm pretty sure he got going again, but he, he was pretty certain he could fix it, so we left him. Um, but anyway, jet boil's boiling. She's really boiling. Uh, decaf coffee at this time of the day because if I have a real coffee I'll be I'll be jumping around like a nutcase but uh, we're having some lunch we're what are we having smoothie bowls we haven't had them in so long because we never have like the freezer side going on yeah. here yeah we've changed um, to the freezer side going because we're in the hot weather now yeah well we actually expected to have them for breakfast but it was so cold this morning yeah it was freezing it was cold eh? yeah um, anyway, that, that's the bungle bungles done in two days. Mm -hmm. Two or three days. It was the best experience we've had for a while. Yeah, it's um, beautiful. It's up there with Fraser, Fraser Island. And Carrageen. And Carrageen. If it had, if it had swimming, it would be yeah. top of all of Australia. I, I, we weren't expecting it to be as good as it was. It, it was just spectacular. And I'm so thankful that it, that is in our um, country. It's amazing. Yeah. But uh, anyway, that's going to wrap it up, guys. We will see you next episode. Where are we going to be? Where are we going? Oh, we're going to Gib River. Yeah. See, <laughs> yeah. Will that be the next episode? Yeah, I think so. Okay. We'll see you on the Gib. <laughs> <laughs> Wish us luck.